Hi and welcome back to Warframe Challenge Accepted. How this works is usually in the comment section below. You just put a comment there as to what kind of challenge you would like to see us do. Whichever one gets the most thumbs up is the one that I try to do the next week. This one, however, a bit like last week's, it's kind of a mix of messages I got in game and the comments thing. Somebody did put in there try chroma. Um, First ability, Spectral Scream or Dragon's Breath or whatever you want to call it. Use that only on a Tower 2 Exterminate in the Void. Not really sure how this is going to go out. So what I've done is I have basically put in 30% power with 40% power. This isn't maxed. Uh, maxed the power out as much as I could. Can go higher, but oh well. Uh, fleeting expertise and streamline for basically 90% extra efficiency and then just stretch to make it go further and health and shields. Of course I have formatted them four times so energy siphon is now here. That had to be done. I have also set them to toxic damage hence the green energy colour. Tower 2 exterminate. Let's go. This is mainly because the damage type. Just to try and get a little bit extra damage obviously once you cast poison on somebody or toxic or whatever you want to call it and you run away because they're killing you hopefully it will do damage over time at least that's the theory so put the pistols away i have to come in with at least one weapon and i just thought i'll clear me back and just run around like that actually i think i'll sit here and wait for my power to uh, max out first wasn't intended, but I've had to put one of these down because the energy restore, well, energy siphon even, aura, stopped working. It cut 161 and stopped. So now I've had to put one of these down, which I really didn't want to do. But it is adding a lot of power now. I even tried pulling the weapons out. Nothing worked. This is going to be hard. Hmm. So Carrier, Carrier, that's not Carrier, that is Death Cube, has been disabled. I'm just going to sort of the other chats, that's not going. And the reason this is going to be a bit of a pain is because of all the enemies. They're shooting at me while I'm trying to do this, so... It is going to be a bit of a problem. The energy efficiency is coming in well, and the Sentinel... Restoring my shields there is coming in really handy. Nah, 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 nah. Wow. Wow. Okay, this is going to be a huge pain to do. Luckily, the little guys are going down pretty easily. But the big guy, she took some killing. And the power efficiency works really well. I expected it to, to be honest. That is something I've been meaning to check on since he came out. <laughs> uh oh. One thing I, one thing that wasn't in this challenge, I should say, is can I use other abilities? It didn't really say. So I mean, elemental ward. Can I cast that? It's only going to last about five seconds. I love that effect on the floor. Looks so cool. Whoa, okay. I will be shooting the lasers. I should have left the laser alive. That was a mistake. Come on, give me my shields back. Running, running, running. Yep, my shields are not coming back quick enough. This guy is going to laser me in the face and I'm going to drop dead. Okay, what the, f what the hell do I do against that? Hmm. Come on. Stand up. I can't stand up. There it goes. So you can't, once you cast that ability, you can't stand up. I didn't know that. That's something I should have looked into before doing this. But yeah, the big guys seem to be a problem. Uh, this guy is probably going to be a huge problem because they heal. As long as that doesn't happen, I should be fine. 
Okay, I think he may kill me before I kill him. I'm moving to try and avoid the arm while do damage to him. So the Xmas people, uh, they're going to be a huge pain. I've found a new trick though. If I hide upstairs, up here in this room, let my shield come back, then I can basically jump down and cast it on the way. Where are you? There you are. Because this thing has taken my shield off before I even got to it. Oh no, there's another one. As long as I don't lose Death Cube, I should have a chance in hell of actually doing this successfully. I'm going to have to go with the don't die approach to this as well. Hence, I, f I liked this little trick. Now the con hitters, because I did notice that. There's another one. God damn. These guys are actually pretty tough. I've just been breaking some containers up here as well. Trying to restore some health. Take my toxic breath. Blah. Looks like you're throwing up all over. Num num nums. Kill it. Kill it with fire. Kill it with fire. I was tempted on using the fire ability. Um, fire element for this. But I don't know, it was just, I just thought, well, if we can cast poison on them, they'll take damage over time. So, after I do run away to try and let my shields and health come back, they'll take damage. That's the only reason I've gone for the the toxic over fire or... Ice would have worked pretty well. Because ice would have uh, slowed them down. So, while trying to deal damage to them, they wouldn't have been moving as much. I had thought of that as well, but the toxin just kind of seemed to work. Always remember when doing silly things like this in the void, or anywhere for that matter, open the lockers. The ammo that drops from it is pretty meaningless, but the money comes in pretty handy. And more than anything else, health. Will this work through the block? Holy crap, it worked through the block. It would have been nicer if I wasn't being shot a bits from the right. I'm going to have to kill this one and run for it. Oh, crap. This is not going to end well. And I can't go hide up there because I don't have sprint on. So I'll have to... You! Oh, what the... Okay, so... What the hell was that? Let me in the hole. Because more health. And this hopefully oh, almost maxed us out again. The health from the containers and lockers and things like that always come in handy, even if you don't need the ammo. And of course, power, not that it's exactly needed, because this thing is actually a lot more efficient than I thought it was going to be. Would you get back here? I need to go kill your friends now. Where'd the big guys go? does work through this, that I like. But where the hell do the big guys go? There's one. Try taking that down. While well, trying to take that down at the same time, and the thing behind it. Now where's the guy with the bubble? Oh, found it. Through the wall. Actually put a bu wow. Okay, I seriously underestimated how bad she was there. And I don't have a melee weapon to get away from this. Literally just melted the shields. That is just... Wow, what the hell am I supposed to do against her? It's literally, she's... I'm doing no damage to her and once my shields go again... I will have to run away. Hopefully I can kill her before the shields go. Good. Ah, stop the ability. Thank you. God damn those flaming uh, specials are going to be a huge pain to kill. This could not have gone any better. I've got another one of these rooms and these things are great because as I said before, getting in any kind of trouble at all, just jump up because there's a ledge right up there. I'm not even going to disable this ability this time. I'm just going to continue. No, wait, I am. 
I don't mind getting shot from in front, can deal with that, but I'm taking rounds in the butt. Yep, hit and run. See us. Ooh. That's why she's still alive over there, even though she's been hit by that laser a few times. I've been hit by this one a few times as well. It just seems no matter what happens, they're, they're just coming back in insane numbers. And you just got to keep a really close eye on those shields. Once the shields go and they regenerate, run. Any more loot rooms? Ah, damn it, I'm all out of loot rooms. I'm just using the guns to break containers and basically shoot obstacles. I'm not shooting any enemies with them. I'm actually keeping my uh, finger well away from... Oh crap, she followed us. I don't have a melee weapon to get out of here. Stop it. I kind of wish I could take control of that guy down there. Nick style. And just regenerate my health. Where are you? I need to take him out before he becomes a problem. Because if I'm trying to kill something and he comes up, then he's going to regenerate their health. Right, time to take her on. I think I've cleared the ranks a little bit. Where is she? See what I mean though? They just they keep coming. Or was that her over at the left there? Nope. She should be just back here. There she is. I'm going to go in with the old kick to the face. And I missed. <laughs> that did not work at all. No. Kick to the face. Oh, wait. That laser did a lot more damage to her than I thought. She was almost dead. Okay, this could be a problem. Um, I'm just hitting up more loot rooms to try and get as much... Holy crap, the double XP thing's still actually going. I didn't realise that. Yeah, just hitting up more uh, loot rooms. I cannot remember which way from here I actually came into the room. But I noticed that purple ring at my feet. That is an energy leech. Yep. Well, so as much an energy leech as what ha will happen is they will take all of your power pretty quickly. Kind of uh, panicked a little bit there. That would have sucked. Poor guy. Yeah, ran into the lasers while I was on the other side. And this guy's trying his hardest to kill me through this thing. Can I take you out before you do? Mm, damn. Well, it was worth a try at least. Come on. Oh no. Oh no. I'm screwed. Okay, at least it came down. Finish it off. It was almost dead anyway. Kill this thing before its friend comes in. Yeah, I seen that. Just hit me in a butt. Jeez. I cannot believe Death Cube has actually survived any of this. Because Death Cube, I uh, format them double XP weekend, why not kind of thing. Because I think I'd only ever done them once before. And he's only level 20. I really expected him to die by now. I mean, we've almost finished this. And he's just up there holding his own. Can't shoot. Doesn't have any mods to shoot. He's basically here just to restore my shields once when they're taken down and that's it because death cube doesn't really do much if you take away his shooting ability okay so i'm heading that way so i'm gonna go loot some more what i didn't expect was that why did that thing spawn in by itself ah oh, damn it it's gonna be one of those isn't it follow it everywhere and not manage to kill anything well last person done that's that then. All done. Nothing to pick up. I was kind of hoping for a reinforced container, but maybe one day. I've had three in total now. The game crashed once. Uh, it glitched once, and I don't know what happened the last time because nothing came out of it. So, yeah, uh, one day I will get one, and I will actually get to keep whatever comes out of it, but till then I will still continue to look. So, we'll leave that off here for now. Thanks for watching and I'll catch you next time.